down. Then we did all the way skips from the G note. Hey guys, welcome back to Easy Keys Piano Tutorial. Today we're going to be continuing our series lesson number four in the Easy Keys Piano Basic Tutorial. And today we're going to be talking about how we can do left hand exercises and how to play all these exercises in a rhythm. But before we get into the video, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any coming videos. If you have any questions in the teaching series so far, make sure to let me know in the comment section and I will be glad to put you through whatever challenge you have. In the meantime, let's get into the video. Now, in the last lesson number three, we were able to do some basic finger exercises after we talked about positioning our hands over the piano and we did right hand exercises which were and the second exercise we did was and the third exercise we did was skips and steps. Skip, step, down, skip, step, down, skip, step, down, to one. Okay? I'm assuming by now you're very good with your right hand. So we're going to do the same thing on our left hand. So that is going to be, remember, your finger numbers. One, two, three, four, and five. So... Second exercise skips all the way. You can do it again. Okay, and the third exercise skip, step, down, skip, step, down, skip, step, down, skip, step, down again, skip, step. Down, skip, step, down, skip, step, down, skip, skip, down. Good. So if you're able to do the same exercise on the right hand as on your left hand, and that's a very good practice, okay? Practice exercise to do. Because a lot of people seem to be right-handed, so doing right-hand exercise is easier for them, and they struggle with the left hand, but you want to make sure whatever, whatever you do on your right hand, be sure to do the same thing on your left hand. Today, I'm going to be giving you three more exercises you can, uh, you can add to your repertoire and practice to ensure that your finger movements are better. I'm going to start with the right hand, and I expect you to do the same thing on your left hand. Now, the right hand exercise goes this way. Now, Remember, we started from the C note in the previous exercise, but right now we're going to be starting from the G note, which is the note on the far right, okay? And we're going to do the same exercise as before. It goes like this. Okay, I'll do it again. Five, three, four, five, four, two, three, four, three, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five. Voila! That's the first exercise. Now the second one is going to be skips all the way. Okay, five, three, four, two, three, one, four, two, five, three, four, two, three, one, four, two, five. Okay, now for the third exercise, we're going to be starting from the key of C and doing this. So 
So I'm doing one five four five three five two five one five four five three five two. You can slow it down. One. Remember, whatever you do, start slow. Learn to crawl before you learn to walk, before you learn to run, and before you learn to jump. Okay, so start slow. So the three exercises are going to be this. Exercise number two, all skips. Okay, then the third exercise is gonna be this from C. Now you want to make sure you do the same thing on the left hand. Okay, the, for the first exercise. Okay. Four, five, four, two, three, four, three, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five. For the second exercise, all skips. Okay. For the third exercise. From C, remember? One, five, four, five, three, five, two, five, one. Now, when you have successfully done the right hand exercise and the left hand exercise or the exercises together, then you're gonna wanna play both exercises or do both exercises on both hands okay now remember in the last class we had three exercises and in this class we had uh, we also had three exercises so you're gonna want to do all those exercises on both hands I'm gonna start from the one from last week Now notice on the right hand I'm doing one two three four five four three two, but on the right hand I'm doing five four three two one two three four five. You see, just because of the way our fingers are arranged, okay? You want to learn how to do exactly this first before any other alternating exercise you want to learn to do this basic one the same way you have other exercises this is all skips from C and number three exercise skips in steps skip step both hands then today we did then we did all the way skips from the G note and then we did the last exercise Awesome. So if you are able to do these six exercises from 
the last two lesson videos, then your fingers are going to be very well exercised and ready to play the piano. Because it's one thing to know the notes, and it's also another thing to play them correctly and promptly. In our next class, I'm going to be talking about how to play these notes or do these exercises and any other exercise on a rhythm. And I'll be breaking what a rhythm is down to you, and it's going to be so much fun. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any videos. If you have any questions, make sure to let me know in the comment section, and I will be glad to put you through whatever questions you have. If you haven't seen the other videos in the lesson series, check out this playlist over here. If you want to see my other videos on more intermediate and advanced stuff check out this box over here and you would have access to those videos in the meantime this is easy keys piano tutorial signing out see you in the next video